This video will explain why you may have trouble having a bowel movement, which is called constipation, what you can do to prevent it, and when you should call your healthcare provider. The normal length of time between bowel movements varies from person to person, but generally going three days without a bowel movement is too long. Other signs that you're constipated include having difficulty passing stool, hard stools, and being unable to empty your bowel completely. After surgery, you may get constipated from your pain medications. You may also get constipated because you're not moving around or walking enough, drinking enough liquids, or eating enough fiber. There are things you can do to avoid constipation. For example, you should go to the bathroom at the same time every day. That way, your body will get used to going at that time. However, if you feel the urge to go, don't put it off. Try to use the bathroom 5 to 15 minutes after meals. This usually works well after breakfast because the reflexes in your colon are the strongest then. It's also helpful to drink lots of liquids. Try to drink eight eight ounce glasses or two liters of liquids every day. Water, juices, soups, ice cream shakes, and other drinks that don't have caffeine are good choices. You can also try slowly increasing the amount of fiber in your diet to 25 to 35 grams per day. Fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and cereals contain fiber. As you increase the amount of fiber you eat, be sure to drink lots of liquids since they work hand in hand. For more information about sources of fiber, ask your healthcare provider for the handout called Food Sources of Fiber or search for fiber on our website www.mskcc.org pe. If you have an ostomy or have had recent bowel surgery, check with your doctor or nurse before making any changes in your diet. Exercise also helps to prevent constipation. Even going for walks will help you stay regular. Both over-the-counter and prescription medications are available to treat constipation. If you want to try medication, talk with your health care provider. You should also talk with your health care provider if you haven't had a bowel movement for two days or if you have diarrhea after taking medication to help with constipation. Diarrhea means you have loose, watery stools more than three times in one day. If you have diarrhea, don't take any medication to stop it without talking with your doctor or nurse first. You should also talk with your healthcare provider if you have any questions or concerns about your treatment. For more information about managing constipation, ask your nurse for printed materials. You can also find information online by visiting www.mskcc.org/pe.